नमस्ते स्टूडेंट्स खुश हो गए हैं आई जे के डॉक्टर वाइकम मिश्रा असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर विद्या के मैथ्स यूनिवर्सिटी जयपुर इन टुडे सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द वर्नेबिलिटी वर्नेबिलिटी इज डिफाइंड एज द एक्सिस्टेंस ऑफ द कम्युनिटी स्ट्रक्चर और सर्विस ऑफ द जियोग्राफिकल एरिया इज दैट इज टू बी डैमेज और इज सेपरेट बाय द इंपैक्ट ऑफ पर्टिकुलर हजार्ड ऑन अकाउंट ऑफ देयर नेचर कंस्ट्रक्शन एंड to the various terrains on the disaster prone area vulnerability can be categorized into physical and socio economic vulnerability physical vulnerability it includes the notation of who are who and what may be damaged or destroyed by nature hazard such as earthquake or flood it is based on the physical condition of the people and the elements at risk such as building infrastructure and their proximity location and nature of the hazards it is related to the technical capability of building and structures to resist the force acting upon them during the hazard event socio economic vulnerability the degree to which a population is affected by a hazard Will not merely lie in the physical component of the vulnerability, but also on the social economic condition. The social economic condition of the people also determines the intensity of the impact. For example, people who are poor and living in a sea coast do not have money to construct strong concrete. they are generally at risk and lose their shelter when ever there is a strong wind or a cyclone because of their poverty they do not are able to rebuild their houses okay it is very difficult for them to rebuild their house okay capacity capacity is defined as the resource in the strength which extend in household and community and which enables them to cope with withstand prepare or prevent mitigation and quickly recover from the disaster people capable are capacity can be taken into account capacity okay, physical capacity social economic capacity physical capacity people whose house have been destroyed by the cyclone or crop have been destroyed by the flood or their homes are destroyed and their farms so family members have been enabled them to mitigate and survive or permanent because the economic condition in which the disaster to suffer their great loss in their physical material which people have the capacity to recover Save the end, save the area, so they own their houses or build build a strong material. Hazards also prevent, also prevalent, but uh, hazards become a disaster only when there is a great vulnerability and less capacity. Okay. What is risk? Risk is the measure of expected losses due to hazards, events, and occurring in a given area over a specific. Risk is a function of probability of particular hazard, event, and the loss and their or their causes. The level of risk depends upon nature of hazard, vulnerability, and element which are affected. Economic value of the, uh, of those elements. Disaster risk management includes all the measures which reduce disaster related to life, property, and assets. Thank you. This session is powered by Three Point Zero Digital India Group, Women's University, Jaipur. If you have any queries, please write down in the comment box. I will resolve it 